What do you race for and what do you rush towards? Everyone rushes to something, even if it's desires and laziness, and everyone needs to have a final destination. Some destinations don't mean anything, they're arbitrary. Some are purely worldly, and some are about the afterlife while neglecting this life, but the believer is balanced. The believer races to Jannah, not against others, but with other people, knowing that it is a race against time and life itself with the limited hours that you have. But what motivates people at the end of the day to rush or to race? It could be hope, it could be fear of missing out, FOMO, and when you know the purpose of life and you know the value of Jannah, you recognize that the only other option in the afterlife is not an option that you want. So you cannot reasonably choose anything but to race ahead. And there is a fear of missing out. There is a fear at times of having shortcomings or being punished. And so when you think of Jannah, you're thinking of motivation and hope for reward. You're thinking about the promise of Allah as a beautiful, complete promise. The promise of Allah is true. Race towards something that has an eternal return. Ali radiallahu anhu, he said, whoever desires Jannah will race towards good deeds. Whoever fears the hellfire will abstain from temptations. Whoever is certain of death will cease to find pleasure. And whoever recognizes this world will bear difficulties with ease. Paradise and the afterlife restore justice for those who are oppressed in this life. And hardships and pain, remember, will be completely erased for those who enter Jannah. Don't let the pain of this life lead you to a greater pain in the next life. And don't let the pleasures of this life distract you from an everlasting pleasure of the next life. Once again, from the journey of life and to the grave and from the grave to the gate, remember there are glad tidings as soon as a believer passes away and they die upon Islam, they die upon the true faith. What ends up happening is the angels of mercy come to them and they say to them at that moment, Allah تَخَافُوا وَلَا تَحْزَنُوا have no fear, no sadness. The place you're going to, you won't be afraid. You won't be sad. But instead, Have the glad tidings of the Jannah that you were promised before. Throughout your life, remember this is the thing that you are racing towards more than anything else. Everyone races, but not every return is the same. May Allah grant us the highest levels of Jannah.